cooking for college. Since I'm a good Catholic Savannah boy, we are doing shrimp Alfredo because it's Friday and I can't eat meat. So, first you want to get your noodles boiling because they're going to take the longest. You get them going good. And then you just do regular Alfredo sauce, that of the jar, it's real cheap. And because it's so thick, because it's so thick, pour a little bit of skim milk in there and it lightens it up. Makes it not as heavy and not as filling. And normally with Alfredo sauce, you do the big thick noodles, you do the fettuccine noodles, but I'm not because I just have angel hair, and uh, <laughs> I just do, I'm just doing angel hair noodles because it's, I mean, it's the same thing, doesn't matter, and that's what I had on hand, and they're cheaper. Alright, and now shrimp, most people think that shrimp is expensive, but if you wait till it's on sale for like $4.99 a pound, this is half a pound, and it's not bad at all, it's actually, I mean, it's, 250 for the meal tonight for the meat and that's not bad at all. And also in this shrimp alfredo, I'm going to put peas because you need everybody needs something green and I love peas. All right. So for the peas, I do the cheap easy way and just micro and just microwave them for like a minute and a half, two minutes, something like that. However hot you want them. All right. And now I've got my Alfredo sauce I got on low because you don't want it to burn. And then I got my noodles going. They're bubbling. They're almost done. I uh, started them a second ago. All right, now the shrimp. Now the shrimp, I'm going to do garlic. I'm going to do them in, uh, I already got my pan hot, so I'm going to get a big scoop, some butter. Melt that butter in there. And let that go instead of olive oil or cooking spray. And I mean, this is not not real butter. Obviously, it's margarine. It's the stuff that's better for me. It's not like I'm eating a stick of butter. So this is not terrible for you. You want to let that melt. Let it go like that. Okay. And you can salt and pepper your butter and throw a little garlic in there. All right. And your shrimp are very easy to cook. They take like three minutes, four minutes. Especially with high heat, it's not hard at all. It's a very quick, easy, simple meal. The thing that takes the longest are the noodles, which actually are done. So I'm going to take them out, turn off my burner, dump them in my strainer. All right, and you want to make sure that the water is good and not in there because a little bit of water will ruin your meal and make the Alfredo sauce all gooey and watery, and it's just not good. So, all right, we got the butter going good. Okay. I got my shrimp over here. I'm going to take them and just dump them right in. All right. Put that over there. I'm just going to keep them. Get them going on pretty high. I mean, eight or nine on your little scale thing. And you can just buy them. If you buy them, uh, are like pre cooked and they're already skinned and deveined and everything, that's ideal. But this week, the uh, they were not deveined, the stuff on sale was not the deveined. So I skinned them and deveined them. It's not hard. You know, you just do one slit right down the back of them and you can peel it off and take the vein out and everything. So it's nice and easy. Alright. I like the already cooked and deveined one. Yeah, whatever. I get the vein out and then the shell off, so it's just as good. <laughs> You just want to make them go, and they'll, uh, you'll know when they're done, because they'll start getting orange, like, you're, like you typically see shrimp. They'll start getting nice and orange. Like I said, they won't take long at all. We just got a second, let them go. And you want to stir your Alfredo sauce, because you don't want it to burn on the bottom, and you don't want the heat up too much. So you can see how I put that little bit of milk in there. And so it's not as thick. See, it's nice like that. Alright, the shrimp, they're going good. They smell great. Alright, put that in there. They're going pretty good. A little more garlic because I love garlic. Like that. Let's see how they're going. And I see how they're already filleted open because I, I cut them and deveined them and everything. Oh my gosh, they smell so good. Yeah. There you go. You got your shrimp like that. Get them all coated nicely. You don't have to do that, Chef. Yeah, you don't have to do that. I'm just, I'm a pro. He's showing yeah, off. Yeah, showing off right there. That's watching too much emeralds. <laughs> Alright, you want to get this out of the way. Make sure all the noodles are good. Don't forget about the peas. Milk. I'm not going to forget about your peas. 
Alright. So you want to take that. Those are done. You want to turn them off. Alright. And now, what we're going to do with these peas, we're going to take them and we're going to we're going to drain them. You can drain them before you microwave them. You know, it doesn't matter. So then some of them go MIA. Yeah, whatever. They'll be alright. <laughs> pour the peas right on in to the Alfredo sauce. Shrimp off and pour them right in the Alfredo sauce. You mix them around. Hey, Ben. What's up? Smells oh, delicious in here. Thank you. Ben's going to promote this, isn't he? <laughs> On Facebook. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where's the peas? <laughs> They're ben, in the sauce. Ben, ben loves peas more than anyone you'll ever meet. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, to serve it, it's quick, easy. You just take your noodles, put them right on there, just like that. You can make this meal whether you're Catholic or not. Yes. We just Catholic needed a non-meat non dinner. I had a request Friday. from a diehard fan on my discussion board. Denise? No. Oh no. No, my uh, my darling sister Christine. Hi, Christine. This meal's for you. <laughs> you can do this for Officer Scott. All right. Scott. Scott. <laughs> All right. Now, you just want to take it just like this. You take your Alfredo sauce and you dump it right on top. Peter likes a lot more Alfredo than I do. Oh, and when you mm -hmm. put your noodles in there, you don't have to let the water boil first. You can throw them in there and let them come to with the water boiling. But break them in half. It makes it a lot easier to eat, not as messy, you know, and just a lot, lot less cleanup after Kira eats because she can get kind of messy Excuse sometimes. Excuse me. All right, so you want to do that. You can what turn napkins are for. <laughs> yeah, that's why God made napkins and detergent. All right, and you just want to take your shrimp and put them right on top. And just dump them right out the frying pan. Oh my goodness, that's so good. And dump them right on there. And I cut these shrimp in half because uh, these were like 30 count shrimp. And the only difference in the in the count, the lower the count, like 15 to 20 count, are bigger shrimp than say like 50 count. And so I don't like the big chunks, so I cut them up and made them a little smaller. But yep, so you just get them like that. Get your forks. And uh, these are great, like if you do like garlic bread, you can do homemade garlic bread, or you can just do crescent rolls or biscuits, you know, something like that. I um, didn't feel like doing any bread today, so I just did the noodles, and the shrimp, and the peas, and the Alfredo sauce. So that's garlic Alfredo noodles with a little shrimp, and that was cooking for college.